Thank you for tuning in to another episode of Crappy NES Games, a series where I play some of the crappiest NES games of all time. I enlisted the help of Crack.com to tell me the top 20 crappiest NES games, and in this series, I'm going to play through all of them, as long as I have access to them. So, let's get into it. This episode... Hello guys, and welcome to episode 1 of Crappy NES Games. This episode, we are playing crappy game number 20, which is Athena. I had it on the title screen, but I had to restart the recording, so I guess it's showing us some um, wonderful gameplay. It, it looks good al already. <laughs> oh, there goes the title screen again. So this is my first time playing this. I'm probably sold this before, but I don't remember it really. So this is going to be my blind reaction, basically. Um, we're going to get into this and we're going to, we're going to see how this is. Um, you already see the, the street looks like it has a face and a mouth. Anyway, we are going to start. Okay. Um, press start. Press, a uh, press start. Uh, did I press it? Oh. Uh. Oh my gosh, what is this music? What's- oh, World of- World of Forest. Okay. Oh no. Okay, so, this is jump. This is kick, I believe. So we have like a double jump, or sometimes we don't jump high, but other times we do. Wait, that- okay, that jump is high, and that jump is high, and this one isn't. Whatever. Take this. This is a lollipop. What? What is? It? Okay, I'm, I'm pick, I, I have it in my hand. It, it's a, a kite, I guess. Uh, no, it's a. Okay, whatever. Just hit the hit the thing. Grab the, the coins. Okay, this is it. Oh, what's that? Can I climb it? Can I do anything to it? Okay, I just wanna ignore it. I'm gonna... Oh, gosh. I'm gonna continue. Oh, the... What was that? Is that slime? What is that? Oh, armadillo? Okay, we're just gonna hit everything that comes up at us. And we got little horse guys. I'm not even gonna go back for them. They didn't even give us a story, now that I think about it. We just- we got thrown into this. And- oh no. Okay. Guess I died. Back again to the, the person tree. Oh, I have to kick it. I have to kick him. I have to kick him. Okay. I don't remember. This is the hit. This is the hit. And this is the jump. I keep thinking it should be the other way around. But just because I want it that way doesn't mean it's gonna be that way. Wait, is it? Can I hit these? I can! Oh! Oh, I got a, a helmet! Oh, those hearts I collect? Great, great. Yeah, I, I think I think I'm getting it a little bit. I'm still not sure why I'm in this world. I don't know why sometimes I jump high and sometimes I don't. That's irritating, but I'm getting a hang of it. I thought I was. She barely moves when you touch the freaking... Oh. Well, did that plant just hurt me? Go out of here. Freaking. This one is not even bothered to hit me. Oh no. I died again.
Okay, I, I want to get past the world of forest. That's what I want to do. I just have to stop sucking so bad. The game is not even that hard. Even though the controls are kind of like... How do I jump high? Am I just doing that by coincidence or... Like, is it by chance, I mean? Do I just have to hold it like that? No, okay, whatever. I'm not... There's no rhyme or reason to it. Um, die. Gosh, this music kill me now. Thank you. Thank you. I'm happy. Okay, well, I'm gonna try it again. Okay, and she just winks at me. Why is her mouth open like that? What is she trying to stick in there? Oh, this is the story. She's in a weird tunnel. She kicks. And... Now she's in World of Forest. It all makes sense now. Okay, let's continue in World of Forest. I'm gonna pick this up. Not really sure what that does, but... but why are the plants just growing out of nowhere? Can someone explain that to me? I don't understand why the plant... Why is the plant just growing? Did I hit it or did it hit me? Okay. Let's continue. Oh, oh my Is that armor? Oh my gosh. I made progress. Should I hit this one too? Is there something right here? Is this one give me something too? Is that a- is that a shoe? Okay! Please! Okay, don't advance the screen because then I'm not gonna be able to go back. Come on! High jump! High! Okay. Good girl. Good girl. Now hit these horse guys. Hit the sentient horses and pick up their sword. Hit the thing! Hit the thing! Hit the thing! Oh no! I was about to get the gold, the gold sword. Oh man. Okay. Let's let's do this again. I think some of this just has to do with me just being crappy and not even the game being bad. I don't know how much of it is me and how much of it is the game. I mean, the controls are kind of like delayed. Nothing is really explained. I, mean, I guess there's probably a control. I mean, not a control manual. A game manual that would tell me what the heck is happening. Okay, I got that. Or at least I would hope there is. I can probably look it up afterwards. Get those hearts! Get those hearts, girl! Why does she make that little runny animation every time she hits something? Like, that throws me off so much. And I have the music up way too loud in my ears, guys. This is... It's already not that great. And I, it's like blaring in my ear right now. Okay, I got two swords. I got two swords. Okay, now I can't hit that, but that's okay. I keep almost- I keep hitting jump when I mean to hit this. Okay. Okay, now I'm gonna jump over here. Sound like the music got a little different. Is that good thing? <gasps> Wait. Are you serious? The little purple glob fucker. Yeah, the clapping stopped. I knew something happened to the music. Why the clapping stop? You know what? I'm happy that 
the clapping stop? It's like hurting my ears. Well, I get the freaking. Yep, I got the helmet again. Get the hearts. Get the hearts, girls. Get the hearts. I guess I'll probably wanna. Yeah, get that. Great. Just hit it. Just hit it. Just hit the thing. Hit the thing. Hit all the things. Hit the guy. Hit the horse. Just jump. You're delayed. Jump. Why does she jump? Oh my gosh. Just, just keep jumping. Why are they phasing like that? Did I hit them? I guess so. I could barely tell. Now there's question marks. What is this freaking Super Mario throw? Uh, this is horrible! They got rid of my armor. Oh my gosh. This shouldn't- this sh I guess I'm- um, I, I can't even talk. It's just little things. It's- this- I guess I wouldn't say this is this is far from like the worst thing I I could play, but why does she do the phasing thing whenever I hit or jump? The enemies are phasing. Oh, it's it's annoying. I'm just interested to see what this little demo does. Okay, it stopped. Um. Anyway, I'm gonna try it like two more times. I want to get past the world of forest. The whole world is forest, I guess. I still don't know what the heck is happening right there. I guess I should really look up a story online. That's probably what I'll do after I'm finished with this, to see what the heck the story is. Anyway, let's stop talking and let's go. This music. This clapping is like my ears. Ear rape. Ear rape at its finest. Just collect the coin bag. Collect the bag. Yeah, this is gonna. Don't even touch the little freaking. I don't even know what the hell that is. Oh, this is nice. Whoa. It stretched out. I thought it would hit him immediately. But let's, let's not act too much of this game. Okay. I'm, I'm hitting the thing. I'm throwing it. I'm. Oh my gosh. Why won't they switch the. I keep hitting when I mean to jump and jumping when I mean to hit. Maybe I'm just dumb. I just think the button should be switched. And it also could be how I have it set up right now on my computer. Grab that. Let's grab that. I might as well just get whatever's over here. This music, I, I keep saying it, but it's it's killing me very slowly, or not even slowly. It's just killing me. Hit these things. Hit the things. Hit him. I don't even want to go down there. He's he's right there. Okay, I got to this part before. They're phasing! Is that supposed to happen? Stop phasing every time I do something! They're glitching out! They don't know what- they don't know how to control themselves. It could be the emulator too. I'm gonna have to look up after this if it's just my emulator. 
Wait, what are we supposed to do? Are we supposed to jump down? Please tell me to jump down. Okay. I was about to say... Oh no! He was just in a freaking... The freaking tree! Freaking Robin Hood behind! Okay, this is my last time. I'm just trying it out anyway. I don't need to be particularly good at this. I'll just grab this one. What is this? Does that make a- wait, does that make a flower? Is that- was that me? Did I do that? I don't know. We're just gonna grab whatever is created. I should've went the other way, cause this is taking longer than it needs to. Hit them. Okay. Where's the horse guys again? Oh, I got a ring. I mean, it's got this thing. Oh, I kind of like that when it works. Wait, are they just falling into the pit? <laughs> what? Okay, you you guys continue being dumb. Thank you for another sword. Okay, I'm, um, that's all I'm doing today. I think that's all that needs to be done. Um, so I will be back, and I'm going to see what the story is, and if there's any, like, in, what is it, game manual that came with this, explains the story a little bit. I'm going to see what people say. Alright guys, so I went to the Wikipedia page. I'm probably just going to have a screenshot of it. I'm going to get a screen recorder that doesn't only record games because that's all I have right now. I guess I uninstalled the other screen recorder for some reason, but yada yada. Anyway, I'll have a screenshot up probably. But it says the plot is that Athena was a young, strong, his strong princess of the heavenly kingdom of victory. When she was bored of the monotonous daily life in the palace and desired exciting adventures, one day she opened the door which shouldn't be opened, like Pandora's box as it sounds like, in the basement of the castle victory, so to lead to a savage and deadly place. Yeah, that sounds really smart, okay. As she did across the doorway, it caused her to fall from the skies into another realm called Fantasy World, which was dominated by the evil Emperor Dante. I have a friend named Dante. I wonder if he would watch this. Probably not. But if so, hello. Anyway, after her flowing dress was lost while catching the wind of her fall, the perilous adventures of Princess Athena began as she landed in the wilderness of overrun by beast-like warriors and more dangers than she could ever wish for. Oh, so that's what World of for World of Forests or whatever it's called. That's what she fell into. And yeah, this of course of course her dress just just got lost. Anyway, I'm ranting. Um Yeah. So there's a sequel and blah blah blah. So yeah, that was Athena. I feel like overall, this game actually wasn't as bad as I thought it would be. It's definitely not great. <laughs> definitely not. But it isn't, it doesn't reach the caliber bad that I've seen with other games, which I'm pretty sure we're gonna get to as we get farther down that list. I didn't even look at what number one is, but I'm pretty sure that's going to be a piece of dog crappy poo. But I would give this game a 2 out of 10, I suppose. Crappy, but bearable kind of. I would never finish it. I wouldn't recommend you finish it. But there's worse things you could be tortured by, which we will see. 
in the next episodes. So stay tuned for another episode of Crappy and the Escape.